there, my lovelies. Um, hope you're all well and you had a lovely weekend. I've been away for a couple of days. And it's taken me over a week to try and catch up with everything. But I'm here now and I've come to show you my little angel journal. Now, it wasn't my original idea. It was a very talent, talented lady called, I think her name's G. Kerr, G-I-K-E-R-R. I will find her YouTube station and I will link it just below. Um, she did a beautiful journal and notebook, but you know me, the tattered fairy, everything has to be shabbied up a bit. So with mine, I have made it a bit shabby and a bit rough at the edges. Um, the longest, the measurement, the longest part at its two longest points is 8 inches and the width at its widest points are four inches. It's ring bound, obviously, because I want it to open out. Um, the cut, the closure is just some seam binding. We've got some pretty little lace nut here, and we've also got. If I can show you, I don't know if it will show up. A little glass bead angel that I've made as a dangle. Now. What all together we've got 31 pages in here which makes it 62 sides front and back there's seven pockets and each pocket's got a heart shaped journal card there's a lace pocket an altar paper clip um, one metal charm is in the shape of a feather two of my doodads one angel bead and three of my little tags so if I open up Okay, the first page. There we go. As you can see, as you open it up, you get your beautiful pair of wings. So, right here's your little lace pocket, and on there is a little ball pin with one of my little dangle tags, which is "Live Your Life." We have a, bus a feather metal charm, a paper clip, an altar one. The front page is a lovely little angel and angel kisses and there's one of these pockets that I was telling you about and the heart shaped journal cards and each one's got a little bit of sewing or a little bit of lace on I've kept it very plain because I thought obviously it's very personal and you either want to do your own messages or your own memories or your own thoughts just a little bit of stamping on the pages, sweet, just a little bit of word in, different kinds of paper in, because obviously it's a junk journal, more stenciling, a little bit of sewing, one of the little charm tags, usual wings, a little bit of lace, now here's one of those doodads with a key on, so what I've done with these, I've actually paper clipped them off, this one is life is beautiful because I thought you might not want them there you might want them somewhere else you might not want them in at all so they are only paper clipped in into the pocket this one's got a little bit of lace on stenciling stamping again very plain so there's a lot of white spaces just a little bit of lace again some stenciling another journaling card very plain. Another little tag. Be fearless. Stenciling music. Little half tag again. Like that. Another little tag. Put a stamp in. Butterfly. Another little doodad with a pearl button. Again, it is only paper clipped in so that if you want to move it or if you want to take it completely off, the choice is completely yours. Little angel girl with a watering can. Another little tag. A pocket. Little bit of lace. Just a bit more stamping. It's all tea stained 
I want for you to use on, on some of the pages I have used a Tim Holtz paper distresser just to give it that little bit of well, I think character some people call it shabby some people but I just love things as they are a little bit of linen in there and there's the end like I said when it's opened up you've got your wings and to close it up you just turn it and tie it up it is in my Esty shop so if you'd like to have a look please do if there's anything you'd like to know about it please contact me nothing's too much trouble so happy crafting my lovelies and I hope wherever you are that the crafting fairy springs spreads a glitter all over you with happiness Take care. Bye.